All right, this is by request. I'm showing you my um, ulcer remedy, okay? Somebody asked me about um, healing your gut, and, and every time I say something about healing your gut, I tell my story about how back in, I think it was 2016, I had been... Um, I had been drinking a little bit too much wine, and it was a cheap wine. I think it was like a Boca box or something like that. Anyway, this is a weird-looking cabbage. but um, So I was drinking more wine than I should have been uh, of this particularly cheap, crappy white wine, and I got an ulcer from it. And I ended up, like, I, I went to the emergency room. They ended up giving me an endoscopy. They put me on all kinds of drugs. Um, I was on uh, those, what are those... Um, pro something or other the, the thing that is supposed to be like antacid because they were like oh yeah this is it you got too much acid and that's causing the ulcer and blah 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 blah, blah. and i ended up with an endoscopy and all this shit so none of that worked i had more side effects than i could possibly have imagined I, I mean like i literally counted 14 side effects just from that one fucking drug so i was like yeah f this i'm not doing that anymore um so i looked up on the internet uh, another, if there was any alternative to healing a stomach ulcer. And this is what I came up with. This is what I found. So this is not originally my idea, but it comes from um, the, the same concept as uh, how eating fermented foods is good for you. I'm not going to put salt in this. This is just a really small head of cabbage, okay? Small head of cabbage. And now I'm, uh, I just chopped it up, stuck it in the food processor. I'm just... Filling that with some water. I'm going to fill it up with water. All right, so I just stopped it. It looks really gross, and I'll tell you right now, <laughs> it doesn't taste very good. So, but this is, it is literally cabbage water, okay? We are going to be making, we are making cabbage water. Funnel. Pull out. If you have a bigger jar, you're welcome to use a bigger jar. This is a quart size jar. It's just the cabbage water. This is a piece of like old t-shirt that I'm gonna use. Just drape that across it, <laughs> lint side up. And just, just like that. So you let this sit on your kitchen counter, like it not in the sun. So like somewhere that's right out of direct sunlight for three days, maybe four tops, okay? And then you can either drink it just as is or strain the cabbage out and drink the, the water part. And you drink that about a quarter to a, somewhere between a quarter cup and three quarters a cup every day, twice a day. Um, and your ulcer will probably be gone in about two days, maximum three. This is what it looks like the next morning. It's all settled, but you can see the bubbles are starting to form and that's the fermentation. That is very good.